Hey, what's up guys? Super quick SEO hack I wanna show you today. This could help you get anywhere from a couple hundred extra views to several thousand extra views on your website every month and it's completely free. So I'm gonna show you how this works right now. Uh, currently I'm helping writejoin.co a little bit with SEO. Um, we've got a blog here. Now what I wanna show you is how to get a free little SEO analysis and also how to read it. So I'm gonna copy that link and I'm gonna go into SEMrush and I'm gonna paste in that URL. It's probably not gonna let me to do this. Yeah, I've been using up the free plan today. You will get three free searches on that uh, free plan. Um, but if you run out, you can always open up another Google account like what we've done here. So I'm gonna search up that domain and we can see not a lot of traffic here right now, 11 organic search traffic. So really anything that we can do to boost this search traffic is gonna be helpful. Now I can scroll down to top organic keywords. There's a couple keywords I can see here. We're pretty high or pretty low positions for these, depending on how you think about it. Um, what I'm gonna do is click view more details right here for these organic keywords. And we're gonna see a few things here. So if I, I'm not gonna be able to sort that by volume, but I can see that we've got some keywords here that are at about 100 volume. So volume is number of searches this keyword gets per month. And so I can see AI interview prep right here. AI interview, whoop, AI interview prep. When I do a search for that, we got three ads, four ads here, and then interview prep AI. We got this website right here. So if I open that up, this is, guys, this is not much of a website going on here. We got a headline, subheadline, two buttons, a video, and then a little how it works section. This should not be ranking first place for any keywords. And that's why uh, right here it gets a 28 uh, KD ranking. So the KD percentage is like, how hard is it to, uh, take over on this keyword. And this one is a 28, which is very, very low. The one above that interview, uh, AI interview coach is 10. You could write the words AI interview coach on a new page and probably rank for that keyword. That's super low. That's super easy to rank for. So now once you know what we can rank for to get more traffic, um, I'm going to show you how to actually publish something that will take over on that ranking. Um, and by the way, if, if you had the paid version here, you'd be able to see a heck of a lot more, but I'm just showing you how to do this for completely free. Okay. So I want to try to take over AI interview prep and AI practice interview, maybe even AI interviews. So, you know, between the three of those, that's going to get me nearly 400, um, monthly search traffic where I'm the top dog, but see these two are at a 50. So those are a little bit harder to rank for. And I can also see um, uh, my current position on these, and I can also see which URL is ranking. And see, it's just the base URL. It's not one of the blogs or anything like that. So I can see there's gonna be a lot of opportunity here. Um, so here's what I'm gonna do to rank for that. What I use is um, tryjournalist.com. I'm a really, really big fan of this. You get your first three articles for free. Okay, so when you open it up, it looks a little bit like this. We're going to choose our article type. We're going to do a blog post. Generation mode, we want to switch that to keywords. And then what you want to do, hold on. I want to try to uh, keep things with kind of discreet here. Let's see. All right, right here, here it is. Okay, I'm going to take that, put it over here. Okay, cool. So what you want to do is take those keywords we want to rank for it, throw them right here. So we're doing AI interview prep. We're doing AI practice interview. And uh, let's see, AI interviews. Okay, so we're gonna try to take over those. Oh, and AI interview coach. So normally I wouldn't recommend using AI blog 
softwares. Um, don't use ChatGPT to write your blogs. That's very outdated. It's not going to work. Trust me, I've tried. Um, you want to really use the most up-to-date AI blog writer at any given time, I would say, because the algorithm for this stuff is just changing insanely fast. And you want to be the guy who has the most human-written sounding blog post for the longest amount of time because eventually anything that it, that's AI written, we're probably going to be able to tell. We're probably going to adapt to that. And over time, Google is going to adapt to that. That's who we're really fearful of here. And so we want to sound as human written as possible. And in my opinion, tryjournalist.com just does an absolutely phenomenal job at that. So I can go through here on content. Um, so earlier I did factual. Let's try creative. Let's try doing a very creative one. Formality, we can go informal, point of view, change the point of view, custom instructions, include, again, we can include some keywords right here. So, oh, I did this wrong, by the way. So each keyword you put in here is actually going to be a different blog post that it generates. So if I'm just doing one blog post, I actually want to put my keywords right here. There we go. And it's going to force feed those keywords into the article. Knowledge. Uh, it costs money to add a knowledge base. That's all good. Structure. Call to action. So put the sign up link uh, for your SaaS company right there. Put the sign up link right there. Article size. I usually max that out. Just cram in more keywords. Um, add your sitemap. So this is really easy. For writejoin.co, uh, uh, write what you can actually do is um, slash sitemap.xml. Okay. Grab that link. Throw it right there. Now it has all of the links in. Um, and you can actually test and preview those and it'll show, yep, there's all my links right there. Increase that link density, I would say. Um, you can do internal linking to this specific pages. Uh, for images, I usually have it pick stock images, but sometimes you get really bad results. Um, I'm gonna try Bing next time. And then videos, do you want it to automatically add a YouTube video? I mean, I just say yes, because if I don't like it, I can always remove it, okay? Then hit generate article. You can also generate the outline. And when you, whoops. Okay, so you do want to include one uh, keyword here. We're going to do AI interview prep. All right, generate outline. outline. Uh, you can actually modify the outline for your blog a little bit before you publish it. Yep, so. Um, Wow, I actually really like that title. I'm gonna send that title over um, in a little bit. So then you can generate that article. Now I've already generated this article and uh, this is the one that we got. So I'll show you what it looks like. Okay, this is what that article looks like. Does that look AI written? You can read this a little bit. This. Eh, it'd be hard to tell, man. It'd be really hard to tell if this is AI written or not. The images are terrible. I don't like the images, but I did skim through this. See, we edited out a YouTube video. The YouTube video is very relevant, and it's from OpenAI, so it's from a credible source. I love this. So we actually published that uh, blog post just now, just about an hour ago. We ran it through... Um, yeah, so after you publish it, what you want to do is, yeah, you want to run that post through Google Search Console because what that's going to do is it, it's going to, um, no, what do you call it? It's going to get that article on uh, Google a lot faster. So um, create a Google Search Console account, um, add your domain in here, and then grab the link to that new article, throw it into here. Um, I don't have direct access to that domain. So I can't right now, but once you're there, hit this request indexing button, just like that. Wait a little bit. Yeah, so it's probably not gonna do this for me right now because I just used this as an example, but you're gonna hit request indexing. It's gonna say, blah, 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 do you wanna continue? Just hit yes. And, uh, oh, there we go. Indexing requested, perfect. So that's gonna take um, your your new page 
from being indexed over the course of a couple of weeks down to it could happen within a couple of hours or even within a couple of days. So like I said, we just did this, so I don't have results yet. I got excited. I want to make this video quick. Um, as soon as I can see how we're ranking on that keyword, AI interview prep, um, I will send you guys an update. We might be ranking right now. Let me check incognito. Okay, we're not quite there yet. Um, it probably needs a little bit more time to index, but should be there soon. So that is the free SEO hack. I love this hack. I use this as much as I possibly can while it exists. Thank you for watching.